YouTube, YouTube, what's up? It's Jock, Jock Calisthetics. I'm here back again. You may know me by J Mitch or Jock Fitness, all right? I switched my name. This is my last time switching my name, all right? Hopefully, you guys are able to see this video, though. I know, like, since I changed my name, it might not uh, come up in the recommended anymore, but we're working our way back towards that, all right? so that you guys can see me alright and you may be wondering why I have this mask on but this mask is starting to be my new trend my new aesthetic because I've been doing a lot of challenges and I want to keep my mask on it's more aesthetic alright but on it for this video today all right, I'm going to be talking about my diet as a calisthenics athlete oh. camera feel alright no stop on recording, no stop on the recording, but yeah, my diet is a calisthenics athlete, alright, so you guys can see my physique, alright. This is my physique as of right now, alright, I'm not too big, I actually weigh 5'5", five five. I'm, my height is 5'5", five five and I weigh 120 pounds, if you guys were wondering, alright, 5'5", five five, 120, I might be a little bit uh, over on 20 last time I took my height of uh, my weight it was 120 that was probably like uh, close to a month ago right before I used to walk around at like 116 or right? I started doing cast this consistently uh, focusing weight loss on cardio so I gained some pounds all right I most likely weigh 120 right now though or, or under a little bit because I haven't gained no weight I've just been getting really really stronger right but to start it off my diet all right so my diet is very simple <laughs> i'm vegetarian if you guys were wondering i do not eat meat um i used to eat fish i don't eat fish right now i'm not eating fish i eat nothing but fruits vegetables and greens all right so uh i eat the same thing every day it's actually just oatmeal i eat oatmeal and then for lunch i eat pasta which is uh spaghetti actually and then for dinner i eat rice and vegetables and that is it that's i literally eat the same thing every day the same exact vegetables the same exact rice the same exact oatmeal um oatmeal with coconut milk and blueberries and then i eat spaghetti chickpea pasta with some uh rouse homemade uh red you know uh pasta sauce and yeah and for vegetables i eat squash uh zucchini mm, what else pumpkin and yeah of course you know i cook it with the seeds uh when i cook my vegetables though when i cook anything i don't use oil uh the only thing i use oil on is my pasta and i use avocado oil all right because avocado oil it has a very uh, high temperature like high it could take a lot of heat all right the thing about let's wait one second second for that plane to pass all right so yeah the thing about like cooking with oils and stuff like as you guys already know you know if you're into like fitness and health and stuff like that oils could be very dangerous for you and when you like heat up certain oils to high um a high very high temperature it becomes very cancerous to your body and not good for you so avocado oil has a high heat resistance uh type of thing you know so that's the only oil I use when I use oil. I don't cook vegetables, rice in oil, none of that, you know. Um, and yeah, that's really, that's all there is to my diet. It's the same exact thing every day, you know, <laughs> very simple. Yeah, I guess you could say that's, you know, that's discipline, I guess. Uh, some I do cheat now and then, but since I always, <laughs> I work out and I eat pretty like clean, like, you know, every day so i cheat sometimes i might get some pizza but when i when i eat i could eat though i could eat a lot man i could eat a lot when i eat you know i could eat like i could eat a lot when i eat i'll cheat with anything though like pizza um pizza anything bro i just really like pizza a lot that's what i was thinking of but yeah that's my diet now hopefully you guys are still here till the end of this video because this is not the end of the video. I'm gonna talk about herbal supp supplements I take. Um, so herbal supplements I take, I take sea moss gel, all right? Sea moss gel, ashwagandha, 
and I take Go to Cola. All right, so those are the three uh, supplements I take. I take two scoops of sea moss gel a day, morning and night, and then I take ashwagandha, uh, three pills in the morning. Also, I take Go to Go to Cola midday. All right, Go to Cola is really like good. It's calming. It's called the herb for enlightenment. It's really good. Ashwagandha. You you guys know about the ashwagandha. If you don't know, it uh, it's supposedly high high in testosterone. Uh, helps muscle growth for sure. Uh, aggressiveness, focus is good for your brain. All right. Um, and sea moss. Yeah, sea moss is just whole body effects, man. It's very energizing. Ashwagandha is very energizing, energizing as well. Um, and yeah, man, that's really it. I take different, uh, herbs at different months, you know, not like, because like, uh, month is like set out this way. Like, no, it's nothing like significant like that. I just take certain herbs like at times and I'll give my body a break from other herbs. Like I used to take black maca. I haven't, uh, I was taking black maca last month. So obviously I finished the black maca powder and I substituted that with ashwagandha, you know? And you know, you do have herbs that are stimulants and others that are like, uh, they're more relaxing to you. I forgot what to call it, but it's not stimulant. Like it's, uh, it's more relaxed to you and, and some herbs do give you energy, you know? So you want to find balance in that. You know, I've taken a lot of herbs, you know, uh, Korean red ginseng, uh, ginger, uh, turmeric, all these, like, herbs I've taken, you know. I Right now, the ones that I like the most, though, are black maca, um, sea moss. I love sea moss, man. If you guys want some sea moss, bro, hit me up. I make sea moss. I have a sea moss business that I, uh, and I make sea moss, man, and I sell it, um, I'm not doing any flavors right now, all right? No flavors right now. I, I mean, flavors, I don't I don't like flavors though, I can't lie, like, flavors are cool, but no. But yeah, man, I'm not making any flavors right now, just straight regular Simo, uh, gel. I was selling on Amazon, um, I closed down my Amazon account. I start, uh, I had it, I had it for a while. I was selling on Amazon for a while, but you know, I closed it down right now. Now I'm just selling really locally. If you guys do want any sea moss though, let me know so I could start up my Amazon account and get those shipments to you guys in no time, you know? Cause it's way like shipping is way more easier through Amazon and stuff. But yeah, uh, that's my diet, you know? And yeah, I just, I eat fruits throughout the day. I eat fruits throughout the day. I don't try to eat like so much to be honest with you, but yeah, man, uh, calisthenics, like you will never, I don't think you, you might not want to eat too much, yeah. Sometimes it's like eating less, your body regenerates quicker, you know. But yeah, man, uh, this is my diet, you know. I thought it was a mosquito on me. <laughs> but yeah, this is my diet as a calisthenics athlete. This is what, it's just my diet. Uh, it's not built for calisthenics, it's just built for like health in general, man for health in general like you know i'm big into um like health health herbalism and stuff like that you know so yeah if you guys want any like type of videos let me know you know any recommendations so uh, yeah man i'm getting yo i'm getting so crazy with my skills man it's coming and i'm training for a planche right now too i'm training for my planche uh front lever pull up my front lever is solid already uh, planche, trying to better my hands than push-ups. Better those, better the planche, you know, those are coming together on my pull days. And yeah, and I mean on my push days and for pull, I'm ch all I'm training is front lever pull-up. And aside from that, I'm just been training like extremely high reps, like for my reps to like increase crazy. So, you know, uh, every now and then I'll come out with some new challenges, you know. I did do a hundred push-ups. Uh, those are way better form uh, 100 good form push-ups on hot concrete uh, I did that last week or this week, you know 
well, I took this on a Sunday. I'm recording on. I'm gonna post it on Monday, so I did it last week. Yeah, you know. And yeah, I'll be coming out with some more challenges. You know, next time we go to 200 push-ups, all right? 200 strict form push-ups. You know, I'm not going back to weighted anytime soon. You know, maybe when it's winter time, not fall time though. Fall time, I'm still not going back to weighted, man. Um, yeah, cause I'm just locked in on on a routine and on a training program, so. But yeah, man, that's my diet, all right? Thank you guys for watching, if you guys are still there. You guys have a great day. And I'm gonna see you, my brothers in calisthenics. Peace.